Idiot men. President idiot men. They convinced us that President idiot men was the worst black that ever lived. And we lost one karma lesson. We forgot. And this is a law of mine, a right law. Y'all want a right law? Here's one. Anytime, anytime all whites are against you, you're doing something right. <laughs> you're doing something right. <laughs> you're doing something right. And hey, you never even heard a liberal white saying something good about any of men. You know what you all forgot? What we forgot? We forgot any of men making those white men carry him on their shoulder. <laughs> we forgot that. We forgot any of men putting on, did something no other African leader has ever done. Putting all the whites out of Uganda. <laughs> and giving their jobs to black Americans. We forgot that. We forgot him making the ambassador from Britain kneel and come into his tent. We forgot all of that. So the apparatus, the middle apparatus went to work. And, they got, and all of those people that idiot men were supposed to have killed, they have never shown us one picture of them. They have never found the bodies. But they convinced us. And therefore they destroyed Uganda. They destroyed Uganda, one of the strongest African nations on the continent. The one who said that if Africa is to be free, black Americans will free it. Because blacks in the United States are the only blacks in the world who have been exposed to mass technology, who have been exposed to world government. That was idiot man. He had to be killed. He had to be in exile. He had to be.